Hi, uh, so welcome to this market watch edition uh, on, on the night of seventh. Uh, so, हम बहुत जल्दी से हम कुछ एनालिसिस करके देख लेते हैं कि कौन कौन सी अच्छी ट्रेड्स चल रही हैं और गोइंग फॉरवर्ड व्हाट वुड बी द सेंटीमेंट सो आज जैसे सुबह मैंने एक ट्वीट किया था सो यू कैन सी कंपनीज लाइक एम सी एक्स बाटा इंडिया गोथरेज प्रॉपर्टीज टाइटन पेज इंडस्ट्री भी एज वेल एज टाटा मोटर्स दे ऑल क्लोज एंड आई आर सी टी सी दे ऑल क्लोज एट इज हाई और ये मैं करीबन कुछ दो बजे ट्वीट किया था Uh, so all of them were able to hold their gains and this is actually looking really good uh, especially for companies like uh, Tata Motors as well as for MCX you can see there was a very nice consolidation happening or we were knowing that ye bahut soon isme ek achhi move aane wali hai when you see uh, this sort of consolidation uh, just some making high highs high lows and this was the reason why this uh, trade actually helped us Uh, also uh, this is also true for uh, Bata India aur iske bare mein main jab ye 1900 cross ki thi tab maine bola tha ki this is uh, something worth uh, uh, tracking and from there it went towards uh, 1950 plus levels at closing and it closed at uh, all time high uh, this is also true for IR CTC IR CTC 4600 uh, 4550 4600 mein ek achhi बेस बनाई एंड देन टूवर्ड्स द एंड इट हैड अ गुड रन टूवर्ड्स फोर्टी सेवन सेवेंटी लेवल्स सो दिस ट्रेंड ऑल्सो वी वेर वेरी मच इगर टू सी अ क्लोजिंग अबव इलेवन हंड्रेड एंड दिस इज एक्जैक्टली वॉट हैपन टूडे गोइंग फॉरवर्ड हमारे जो भी पोजिशंस थे हम वो सॉरी हम वो इलेवन हंड्रेड में बुक कर लिए थे एंड दिस इज ऑल्सो वॉट आई ट्वीटेड दिस वॉज माई टारगेट एंड देन वी वेर uh monitoring 1105 levels which got broken and from there it went towards a uh, 1126 level so uh, let's see how this uh, pans out <laughs> and also uh escorts is also one of the companies it uh, closed at uh, 1520 levels and this is also what i have been discussing a lot of times over these uh, sessions ki hum pehle kahi bhi khareedte hain hum 1500 1505 ke range mein we were booking out and today also that's what we did and we were just uh, waiting for a strong close and this is exactly what came today uh, let's uh, i'm uh, may uh, uh, on these particular days if you look into the videos i've created i was always uh, saying that you know let's go should go again towards uh, the new all time high and this is uh, at least uh, the first step towards it by giving a strong close uh, voltas also we tweeted in the morning uh, so here it also closed at is high hamara 1300 ka target abhi bhi uh, barqarar hai it went towards the levels of uh, 1290 and let's see if it is able to breach uh, 1300 tomorrow and then sustain mathi also maine uh, seven uh, subah uh, jab we 7420 uh, break kiya Uh, which was our our trigger level and from there it went towards 7550 and uh, when it crossed uh, 7550 we started uh, booking and this is also when i tweeted and going forward achhi hoti agar ye 7500 ke upar ek closing deti uh, but at least uh, uh, is this uh, something better than nothing now let's see uh, what the next uh, candles could, could be uh, so kal agar 7500 ke upar agar khul ke agar uh, ek ghanta sustain ki then definitely uh, this is uh, slated for a much higher target towards 7800 and 8000 in the short term chola fin also maine uh, tweet kiya tha uh, during market hours uh, when it broke uh, the levels of uh, 580 uh 580 was acting like a hurdle for uh, a few 78 uh, sessions over here and today uh, it was the first time so multiple times it came to us 580 and again yesterday also it came and there was a heavy sell off but today it was able to maintain so uh the much better closing would have been uh, closing above 590 uh so we have i was expecting it to be happening uh, today then that would have made uh the chances are uh, pretty high for a new all time high in chola fin uh, in in the very near vicinity that didn't happen so it seems like it is going to take some time and maybe it will again uh, go and face some resistance around over the uh, levels of 600 but definitely this is also one of the trades uh, we are in uh, i have been talking about chola fin a lot it's one of my favorite companies in uh, in which uh, i have always been able to make uh, meaningful serious money uh other than that also mfsl maybe mere ek strategy thi this will uh, we will discuss uh, later on uh the good thing is also ubl was able to give a strong close above 1600 uh, so this was also one of the criteria of one of the things we were looking for aur ye humne and also uh, mcdowell uh, went towards a 52 week high of 900 plus it gave us closing near about 900 
सो टूगेदर ऑल्सो आज रेडी को भी ऑल टाइम हाई बनाई है सो ऑफकोर्स द all this uh, liquor beast ca- companies they all uh, moved uh, together uh, one of the things is also good is a strong closing came in excite industry there has been a lot of consolidation since uh, 23 2025 uh, sessions aur abhi thoda thoda lag raha hai ki maybe uh, we are just are waiting for a levels of uh, a closing above uh, levels of 190 and then we can see some really good and quick move uh mutut finance uh, we were discussing yesterday how uh, mutut finance was able to maintain the levels of 1500 and today also you can see that from there it went towards the levels of uh, 1590 though there was a sell off and it was unable to close above uh, the levels of 1560 but uh, still uh, this uh, uh, this was a good uh, trade uh but though it didn't uh, give us a uh, uh, 1600 target but definitely this is uh, going to do uh, one of these days emphasis you can see it's making higher highs higher lows and i am very much optimistic one of these days it will again go towards the 3500 level so uh, i have already have had positions co forge also we have been talking about how i i have positions in all the major or uh, uh, mid cap it companies except uh, nokri for now but uh, we are just waiting for some uh, trigger and signals in nokri then we will uh, be making positions other than that uh, uh sun pharma this is a very uh, typical um bullish uh, structure uh, so going forward definitely i won't be surprised if uh it is able to uh, take out uh, the new uh, 52 week high which is just created four sessions ago at a uh, level of 840 uh so from 840 it corrected towards 800 and then it got a support we said it was a uh, okay uh, closing because it was able to at least hold the levels of 800 on a closing basis and then again it's uh, up now to uh, 825 levels Mm, Bharat Forge eight uh, hundred we are waiting for and now let's see uh, very quickly we are going to look over all this. <coughs> uh, PVR fantastic uh, structure LTTS also. Uh, uh, let's see granules nothing mm, okay LTTS also. I have created positions over here. Uh, we talked about and today I, is the first day where I am seeing that you know all these positions which were created. Uh, it is uh, trying to give us a move. Mm, of course, uh, right now uh, there is an immediate hurdle at uh, for forty-seven, forty-eight uh, hundred levels, forty-seven and ninety to forty-eight hundred levels. Uh, but one of these days, I'm pretty sure this is going to breach, and uh, very soon we might be seeing a lot of um, uh, movement. So here also you can see even in companies like Tech Mahindra, which were just uh, lingering. Uh, also you can see SCL Tech. Ye jo indecisiveness thi. Abhi thori thori karke lag raha hai ki strength is coming. You can also verify it in TCS. So uh, this and uh, Mind Tree also. So this is exactly uh, what I have been uh, talking about um, in. Uh, Uh, I I have been talking about uh, of how uh, you know uh, maybe we can go with a video banana the last weekend ko just maybe bola tha that this week uh, at least uh, you know buying and dips in uh, uh, in IT is definitely going to uh, reward so at least uh, three just sessions mein achhi dikh rahi hai and uh, let's see how this momentum continues at least uh, for uh, the next week uh, pl fantastic humne uh, 3000 ka humne hamara jo target tha short term uh, we uh, achieved it so all the positions which we have created earlier they were all created with uh, uh, taking uh, 3000 as our target and we added more when uh, we had a strong closing at a uh, uh about for uh, 2800 levels and from there again uh, in just a couple of uh, three sessions we attained uh, 3000 i also created some um, intraday position uh, which i tweeted some one and a half to jab mujhe dopahar ke ek der baje shayad tweet kiya tha ki pel is now going to move and that's exactly what happened pel tab 2950 levels pe thi so we were able to get a 50 uh, uh, quick and smooth points uh, the thing is you have to understand it's not about the 50 points it's just the if you are able to get even a 1% of a trade uh, and if this is uh, such a beautiful and uh, high probability of success rate as the structures one thing and then it actually helps a lot because then it takes away all the all the tension pretty light also is a nice a very nice move has come in and definitely it's a very near to its all time high uh, going forward uh, there was a news flow in pel and so going forward i think i won't uh, be uh, trading pel for now i am not a big fan of all the uh, demergers and uh, generally uh, i uh, have uh, i always i i want to trade uh, stocks 
uh, based on the chart patterns uh, so with demergers and all these things uh, there will be a considerable portion of uh, value uh, erosion in uh, pyramid that will actually also break out all the levels and so it will be very hard uh, for me to take any uh, future trades based on a uh, technical analysis so i think it was a good journey in uh, pyramid for me it was also one of my favorite uh, p company uh, starting with uh, um, uh, alphabet p uh, so i think uh, for now uh, this is all i had for pyramid uh, but uh, no matter what uh, p light is definitely going to be one of the companies uh, which i have got to uh, keep a close look at LTI may uh, may I tweet here. I have been creating positions and uh, they are still ongoing. I'm one of these days. I'm just waiting for a, a strong close above uh, six thousand and definitely then in no time we will be going towards all time high. It's just a matter of a market. All the industry also made a new all time high today and this is also what we have been trading uh, since uh, this particular day uh, when it broke uh, this uh, box uh, which was there earlier and from there we can see we got a good move. and other than that uh, bajaj auto see uh, th this is the thing right just because the sector moves doesn't mean all the companies will move uh, if a sector moves and if uh, i was seeing some um, uh, big tweet uh, to ex uh, tweet experts and uh, financial experts and people who give a lot of um, uh, uh, tips trading tips uh, they were talking about uh, bajaj auto uh, but uh, theoretically uh, this is you have to understand is the market is giving a breakout of a 52 week uh, as uh, you should be uh, taking part in those uh, trades and not uh, be uh, stuck in trades uh, where uh, there is absolutely very uh, less uh, chances of a new breakout right uh, so just for example kuch din pehle chemical stocks were working so i was more interested in deepak nitrate right? and i was more interested in srf uh, just to see the amount of return you can get and i was absolutely not interested in navin florin Uh, so this is the same logic. Uh, Navin Florin, a box with you, scored four thousand uh, egg strong. Uh, uh, so, uh, there was a strong boundary. There was strong resistance which had to be broken, and so uh, just go for all-time highs and uh, you know fifty-two week highs. So definitely, this is going to uh, give you a much better trade. Uh, case and point in auto, we are carrying positions in Nescots and Tata Motors. So of course, uh, these are the two trades which I am very much hopeful of. For Bajaj Auto to be of our, our interest, at least uh, we expect a closing above four uh, thousand. Uh, until then, absolutely, this is not in our radar. And other than that, uh, nothing much. Uh, PI Industry was again able to close above thirty two hundred. This is also one of my favorite companies in P. Uh, ICICI also seven hundred Q per uh, closing the year. And so uh, this is just trying to enter the box. Actually, uh, that's the thing. Uh, so, market is already very near to its all-time high, and you can see there's uh, still so much scope uh, left in big companies like ICICI uh, and also Reliance. Uh, okay, Tata Power is nice uh, consolidating at higher levels. It's making higher lows, so this is actually uh, still a good point. Uh, uh, we were able to create some positions yesterday at uh, 174 levels, uh, and then we were uh, taking out positions at 177. and uh, then eventually today when there was a gap up uh, opening at and it was nicely consolidating at 180 levels uh, so from there it went towards 184 so it was a very quick uh, mujhe if, uh, if i'm not wrong it was just within 5 10 minutes 15 minutes shayad hoga ki it was able to jump from mm, the levels of 180 to 184 so uh, 184 is the 52 week high uh, resistance it's facing right now So let's see how it comes out of it. Apollo, uh, Vipro, uh, there's nothing. These were all in channels, and now this is uh, shifting downwards. Not of interest to us. Uh, Go through this consumer also. Hardly analysis. Eleven hundred Cooper closing at here. We won't be interested. Uh, Bosch, uh, nice consolidation after yesterday's good move. Uh, but again, this is not one of the companies which I have much uh, faith and respect. Uh, it's because uh, of uh, of of of, of nothing uh, company related is just like i know the technology which bosch uh, limited uses and i really think uh, there are much better options for me from a uh, investment perspective uh lt also nice you uh, 1700 make support lene ki koshish kar rahi hai one of these days it will shoot up towards 1800 so uh, make small positions hold Else, uh, as the moment I get towards seven hundred fifty Cooper, then we will be uh, much more be creating positions. Uh, Jubilant Food also four thousand. Go break. Karke, four thousand. Ke 
एंटर करने की कोशिश कर रही है दिस वॉज नॉट पॉसिबल एंड ऑल्सो इंडिको ऑल्सो इट हैड अ फॉल आउट फ्रॉम द टू थाउजेंड एंड नाउ इज अ ट्राइंग टू एंटर द टू थाउजेंड क्लब टोरेंट पावर ऑल्सो इज अ वेरी मच कॉन्सोलिडेटिंग एट ऑल टाइम हाई रीजन ऑफ फाइव ट्वेंटी फाइव टेन फाइव हंड्रेड इस रीजन में वन ऑफ दीज डेज डेफिनेटली दिस इज गोइंग टू गिव अस होपफुली अ गुड मूव एंड मेक अ न्यू ऑल टाइम हाई uh mnm finance also uh, is one of my um, one of the trades uh, uh, which is also looking good uh jab tak ye 180 ke niche closing nahi deti hai there is absolutely nothing to worry hal has been facing a lot of resistance you can see at 1400 levels whenever it's strong so one of these days um, hopefully hal as uh, should uh, be able to hold uh, the levels of 1300 uh, in general aur ye 1400 iske beech mein hi atki hui hai nam india fantastic uh, it made a all time high uh and then is a nicely consolidating and this uh, structure is very similar to trend and from uh, experience we know that this is definitely going for a good all time high similarly uh, mfsl is one of the companies uh, jahan pe humne 1000 uh, pe trade uh, banaye the positions and we talked about it and from there we are going towards the levels of 1050 1044 Uh, so we are already sitting in a four percent trade. Hopefully, one of these days, it's go. It has to go towards eleven uh, hundred. Uh, or if it goes from here, so basically, after a downturn, these uh, sort of moves are very uh, uh, risky structures. Because if there is any thousand thing which is closing, it will be very much uh, detrimental for the stock, and there can be much further correction. Uh, power grid also one in ninety levels. Ko chhona nahi chahti hai, and it's just because of uh, you know the. Uh, uh good news uh, floating around this uh, structure the, this particular sector uh so nokri is one of the companies where we have not yet created our positions uh the e6500 say thodi si upar hai yeah let's see uh, i have already a uh, positions in all the other um, uh, uh it uh, mid cap companies dixon also 4950 tak gayi thi aaj uh, 4962 tak gayi thi hamara position hum 4952 mein uh, book kar liye the and from there it corrected towards um, Uh, 4870 levels, but no matter what, very strong uh, consolidation mm-hmm. and very uh, beautiful uh, structures are happening. Uh, so uh, yeah, keep this in your radar. Reliance, fantastic consolidation. Now uh, don't be stupid. <laughs> Reliance, yeah, pe. जितना भी time spent करे one of these days it is going to blast uh, this 2620 levels and for us. uh the next target would be uh, 2750 levels and this is uh, what i have uh, at the back of my mind yesterday we created some positions uh, at uh, 26 uh, um, 60 uh, levels uh, uh, 2560 levels uh, sorry 2560 levels or wahan se aaj ye opening 2595 mein ki thi we knew uh, that you know 2600 may act like a hurdle so we booked out at 259798 region and from there uh, it was able to uh, dip towards uh, 2570 or usi mein hi thi so it was a very narrow range uh, so definitely going forward uh, just as soon as ye 2620 uh, break karegi i would be allocating a huge chunk of my intraday capital in reliance and i would be uh, uh, i would be taking part in it so one of the things you can see that uh, even uh, you know you will see state bank of india today was unable to hold the levels of 463 this will come in icici bank hum dekhe hain is barely is barely at uh, 700 reliance you can see it has at least uh, 40 50 points uh, for uh, uh, away from its all time high so the market is definitely looking good and this is how it should be uh simpler we talked about uh, a few sessions ago uh, when this particular candle was formed and we talked about 900 and this was actually achieved today uh, so definitely normally uh, what happens is uh, i don't actually tweet about my uh, short trades uh, because uh, those are the trades uh, which you have to be carrying in uh, future or options and definitely uh, they come with a, a capital requirement as well as also uh, they come with a, a risk बट इन जनरल सिपला का हमारा नाइन हंड्रेड का टारगेट था एंड डेफिनेटली दिस वॉज अचीव सो इन जनरल इज राइट नाउ इन अ बॉक्स एंड देर इज आई थिंक गोइंग फॉरवर्ड वी यू कैन एक्चुअली एक्सपेक्ट अगेन सिपला गोइंग टू वर्स अ लेवल्स ऑफ नाइन फिफ्टी नाइन सिक्सटी इन 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 शॉर्ट टाइम बट अगेन डोंट यू नो इन्वेस्ट टाइम इन दीज ट्रेड्स द मनी इज एल्सवेर एंड सो यू शुड बी इन्वेस्टिंग इन दोज पर्टिकुलर सेक्टर इन कंपनीज 
uh, Bajaj Finance uh, is also uh, making high highs, high lows. Uh, today again, we booked out at 7880 levels, and this is when I tweeted. Uh, yesterday it closed at uh, 7700 levels uh, so it was a good move again it uh, corrected and closed to 7750 levels and this is perfectly fine because it's always making high lows uh, which showcases uh, there is uh, still strength left Hamara target of 8000 is still intact and we are going to expect it in this particular uh, month definitely hopefully so even you can see that big name bajaj finance also has a lot of room left right now right we be a coach uh, the 250 points away from all time high here uh, state bank of india fantastic uh, so we booked out of our positions at 463 uh, in the morning and this was hit uh, in the first uh, 5 10 15 20 minutes of the trade uh, 453 mein positions big gayi thi 463 mein, and this is also what i have been talking explicitly 463 should be your uh, your benchmark and you should be seeing hum 463 ke upar hai, ya hai. in general as i said yesterday also uh, in general uh, state bank of india is in a box and uh, the only advantage is it's uh, just uh, making high lows and uh, one of these days we expect the 470 to be uh, breached and that day can be uh, tomorrow or can be uh, in, in uh, next uh, Tuesday. Uh, but no matter what, uh, definitely um, I have a lot of uh, lots of uh, State Bank of India in cash. And definitely I am expecting uh, some uh, good return from it in the short term. Uh, the day it will be able to uh, give a strong closing above 470, we would be then doing an analysis for the next uh, targets. So again, State Bank of India also is uh, some 15-20 uh, points away from its all-time high. So uh, what I'm trying to showcase is that if you top constituents, there's uh, still a room left uh, for all of these companies to touch the all-time highs. And still Nifty is uh, making uh, such good moves uh, and at high levels. Uh, so definitely, I am pretty confident one of these days we should be seeing um, uh, all-time high soon. Uh, as always, I am away from all the insurance companies. Again, uh, Kotak Bank is also trying to take some support from uh, 1950 levels. One of these days, it should be able to close above uh, 2000. And so from there also, you can see Kotak Bank has some uh, left. Uh, in general, we would be just waiting for Kotak to close above 2000. And then only we would be deciding. Uh, in general, uh, I have scanners running throughout the day. I have softwares. So it's absolutely not a problem. Just uh, keep following me in uh, Twitter. And then hopefully if I get a... A uh, notification an alert of uh, something good going on in Kotak Bank uh, then definitely I will uh, tweet about it so and uh, definitely it's one of the stocks I'm tra tracking uh, Access Bank is also uh, facing some resistance at 800 so we would be tracking uh, closing for access NDPC both achieve fantastic structure here if this PSU not we would have been trading it Astral also we are expecting a nice consolidation I started here today there was absolutely very small moves uh, we are expecting 2500 and that uh, is what my uh, target would be for the short term and uh, so now we are towards the end so in the end you can see uh, so uh, the placement of the chart is basically based on an algorithm of mine in which I actually find out how the positions and the strength and the weaknesses so here jab hum aate hain, so we can see that you know today uh, was not actually a day also for mm, uh, chemical companies you can see the button trade over here nice consolidation but at least it was not uh, a top uh, trade and hence you can see it's towards the bottom uh tata came also is, uh, is at all time high and still uh, there was not trade uh, and uh, similarly you can see there are some cement uh, sectors and you can see there is britannia hindustan unilever nestle so this actually uh, is the reason why i uh, when i'm creating a short video i actually make it based on this particular algorithm of mine it actually helps me in ascertaining all the all the all the sectors and then you know it gives me an idea a much better idea also you can see navin florin here so you can see deepako nitride tata came navin florin so this actually gives you that you know for today's perspective, आज ऐसी कोई पैसे नहीं घुसे हैं इस केमिकल सेक्टर में और ना ही ये कुछ घुसे हैं ऑन एफएमसीजी सेक्टर्स 
Uh, so definitely going forward tomorrow, these two sectors won't be at the top of my mind. Uh, Dr. Reddy, 5000 is a strong resistance and hence you can see it's again correcting towards the levels of 4800. In general, 5000 go per uh, strong close karke. It was able to sustain but again, uh, when this particular candle came and then from there it's now again in a box. So in general, agar aapko, um, if you are interested in uh, what do you say in pharma, uh, stick with uh, Sun Pharma or stick with uh, Sipla. So yeah, though, but actually, Alchem be is one of my favorite uh, structures. I've been ongoing over here. Yeah, exactly. So Alchem is also one of the uh, good companies. Uh, just me, it seems like uh, one of these days, yeah, a four thousand ko break karegi, and this is a very typical uh, bullish structure. So keep a uh, look out for Alchem if you want. And in general, of course, uh, the money is now flowing in uh, companies like uh, IRCTC, Trend, uh, Bata India, right? So uh, take these into considerations. And other than that, of course, Ashok Leyland, we 136 k upa chili gayi thi, and it closed at 135 uh, levels. Uh, but this is exactly what I've been talking about uh, since the last uh, few days, where uh, we talked about uh, definitely 136 is in the cards. In general, you can see uh, so from um, lockdown uh, perspective, ABFRL, uh, Titan, uh, Bata India, so uh, this Indian Hotel. Uh, so uh, so these are few of the companies uh, which are uh, where the money is flowing other than that of course you have a very big uh, uh, sector which uh, is showing, uh, showing some really good moves uh, Tata, uh, Tata Motors, Escorts, uh, Ashok Leyland, uh, M&M uh, so uh, and also Mother Sansumi but uh, definitely is uh, Mother Sansumi is not of an interest to me M&M is uh, particularly interesting for me 850 ka hamara target tha so that got uh, uh, um, um, the, the target was achieved and from there you can see again it was able to take out 850 and now it's going towards uh, 880 was a strong a strong resistance uh, so we will be tracking this no matter what M&M is also looking really good but of course uh, I think for me agar mujhe uh, self uh, dohi companies ko track karni hai, track uh, Tara Motors and also track uh, Escorts. So these two would be uh, really good for me. Uh, Maruti is also there. So you can see that uh, there is this uh, specific uh, companies and specific handful of stocks. Uh, so try to be in that uh, sector. Uh, also you can see that uh, McDowell has always been uh, a much more powerful uh, structure, powerful stock compared to UBL, though I prefer UBL over McDowell, but it's just a personal, uh, it's, it's, it's more of a, of a uh, see there are two things first of all is how you prefer the fundamentals of a particular company with another uh, and also uh, the way the past uh, charts have moved in UPL. Uh, they were much better than McDowell, but in the short term, definitely McDowell's uh, chart is far better than that of UBL. And this is also what we have tweeted earlier. So this is also going good. Also, my one of my investments, uh, which uh, I did, uh, it has now uh, given a, a two and a half times return over a period of one year. Uh, so that was in Radico and this is also uh, what I tweeted and I am definitely planning to hold more of a Radico and try to buy in dips. I have a uh, huge uh, expectations from Radico and of course uh, uh, my trading strategy, I, I, I deploy a lot of trading strategies and one of them is also buying stocks uh, which are weak which are correcting which don't have strength which are just lagging and uh, that uh, in that category definitely uh, is the reason why i am actually creating positions in uh, all the mid cap id and this is also what i have been talking since the last uh, few sessions from here onwards uh, that you know i know it will correct uh, so i am just uh, entering at uh, various levels as in when the dollar comes in and the reason is uh, my actual uh, portfolio is more with uh, IT companies uh, because I come from that field I know how it works I also know uh, what the headwinds and the tailwinds are so I really don't have to actually wait for the media to tell me of why something happened so uh, on a closing note as always uh, stay away from the news and try to find structures uh, just uh, a few months ago one or two months ago uh, two three uh, two months ago uh, Tata Motors were corrected from the levels of 360 and it went towards uh, 260 and it was based on some media news speculations about a uh, chip shortage the story has not changed from that day till today but you can see that you know how uh, you know all these uh, speculations and b b because many a times uh, the thing which I always find 
quite funny is every time a move comes in uh people always try to justify it and i really think uh, we should not be doing it it's just a matter of uh, we as traders we just uh, study the chart uh, just like uh, uh, and uh, just like you know just like that we trade right so uh, for us uh, we should not be uh, too much bothered about the headwinds and the tailwinds because if a news of a particular news comes to your end just do remember the fact that it would be you would be the last person to know it and the whole of the market knows before it so you have absolutely no advantage of uh, taking part in that news right you can retailers and so uh, basically uh, don't try to justify yesterday when nifty corrected they were all like everyone was shouting about moody's i didn't even knew there was a moody upgrade i mean we are traders we don't care about whose upgrade create some what sentiments and everything yesterday i tweeted in the morning that today is not a day of trading try to uh, stay away from it you don't have to buy it you don't have to sell it and i see if the people who actually sold it yesterday today they didn't even get a chance to close their shots because it opened with a gap up the whole the day it was able to sustain uh, so theoretically either you have to do a lot of fire fighting and the worst thing is you are actually m- missing out the profits so just do important uh, steps jahan pe aapko lage ki ha ye company achhi hai and just do remember never wait uh, for a, a particular correction because if you are waiting uh, the correction won't come and if the correction comes and if you have been waiting for long you won't have the courage to buy it always buy and deploy some of your funds and ride the growth uh, the market is not going to uh, just change the mood in a matter of one or two sessions Uh, definitely it would be giving uh, red signals and when that comes in definitely if i am still alive i would be tweeting of how i am exiting my positions and how i am booking out the profits till that time comes hopefully let's all ride the bull ride and hope for a uh, better profitable trades thanks a lot for listening enjoy your evening and bye bye do remember trading should not be a stressful endeavor it should be a simple one where you deploy your funds and then you are able to achieve your targets uh, the thing which i can't guarantee is the timeliness so just like if yesterday if i would have known that irctc would have gone to us a 4750 plus then definitely i would have uh, deployed all my funds right so definitely you never know how and why the market will move uh, i remember the day when we actually created positions over here at 4000 and just in a matter of day we uh, we went to us for the 800 levels so that's just a 20% move in a matter of 24 days uh, whereas there has been a lot of stocks where we have created positions just like in voltas uh, today was a day where we were lucky that it came out of consolidation uh, similarly excite industry may be many positions there 180 178 its level pay so we i never know of how the move and when the move will come Uh, and uh, we as traders uh, we are not astrologers our job is not to predict but is our job is to look and study and then take necessary decisions thanks a lot for listening bye bye